Hello everyone! My name is Birdie and I am your friendly neighborhood forest witch and in today's video I am going to be doing a Halloween haul with a little bit of fall decor sprinkled in as well. So I have items from Target, Walmart, Dollar Tree, Home Goods, Spirit Halloween, and Ross. So it's a little bit of everything from numerous stores. So without further ado, let's get into this haul. So first I'm gonna start with what I picked up from Target and I only got one fall item from the Dollar Plus section and it's this adorable little acorn basket. I absolutely love it. I think it's gonna be an all year round piece for here in the altar room. I think it's gonna go perfect in here. Then I also picked up this tray and I thought this was really pretty. I love this color green with the gold. So I picked this up and I forgot to tell you the price. So this was $5 and the tray was $5 as well. Then I also found this cute little crow. It's wearing a witch's hat. And then on its back, it's got moon and stars. I just thought that was so adorable. And this one was $3. And then I also picked up the apothecary bottle. I thought this was really pretty. Hopefully it's coming up on camera for you. It's really faint. Now I have seen other people who have picked this bottle up. They'll actually fill it with a liquid, but unfortunately the little embossing here doesn't show. So that's really unfortunate. I don't know how to remedy that. Maybe if you do some sort of rubbing over it, like a gold or a silver, I'm not sure if that'll stick it out more or not, but I don't think I'm going to fill it up. I'm just going to use it as a plain decor piece. And then I also found this crystal ball. I thought this was really pretty and yeah, that's really glass. I was thinking it was plastic, but that's actually really glass. So this is really nice. And this one was $5 and the bottle was $5 as well. So this one, I think it'll be really pretty to do a little terrarium with moss in there, but I mean, you could essentially fill it with anything. It looks like it has a seal. So if you wanted to fill it with some sort of candy, like candy corn or something like that, that would be really cute as well. And then I also picked up this lantern. Now they had two of these. They had a black one that had a back cut out and then they had this orange one with the moon and the stars. Now I was really hoping this one would be black because this is right up my alley for an all year round piece. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to paint this a like spray paint it a matte black. So I'll take this little hanger off when I paint it and then I can put the hanger back on. But yeah, orange isn't really my vibe for all year round. But yeah, that's gonna look great black. And then my husband really likes spooky mugs. So he picked this up and this one, he already took the tag off, so I'm not sure. It was probably around $5. And on the inside, it says spooky vibes. So he got that one. Oh, and I forgot to tell you how much the lantern was, $5. And then I also picked up this stinging nettle candle and this was $3 and it smells so good. Absolutely love that. And I love the packaging of the jar. It's so pretty. So after the candle's done, I'll definitely be using the jar as a decor piece as well. And then in the threshold section, I found this huge cauldron candle. And the smell of this one is firewood and patchouli. And it smells so good. Absolutely love that. So, and you know I'm going to be keeping this ceramic 
cauldron after the candles burned as well. That'll be a beautiful decor piece. And then I also picked up some Halloween toys for the kitties and the dogs. So this little squirrel, <laughs> this is so cute. It's a little squirrel that's dressed up as a witch and she's just so adorable. And this one is for puppies and it was $5. Oh, I forgot to tell you how much this candle was. This was $20. So a little more expensive, but it is really heavy. This is ceramic, so I thought it was well worth it. And then the other one I picked up is a cat toy. So you get this little cauldron and it has an eyeball. It has a fish skeleton and a frog in there. So it's really cute. Absolutely love that. And this one was $8. And then my Walmart is just now starting to put Halloween out. So they really don't have a lot out yet, but so far, I've picked up this witch's hat garland. So it's just these plain black hats with the gold belt clip on there. And I thought these were so cute. So this is what it looks like. And this was $5.97. And then also at Walmart, I picked up these silicone cauldron sets. So you get two of them and it looks like you can use them to bake in. So if you wanted to do cupcakes in there, that would be really cute. And then it also shows some popcorn in there as well. And these were $5.98. And that's all I got at Walmart so far. And then now let's move on to Dollar Tree. So every year they come out with these really cute storage containers that look like spell books. So I picked them up this year again. This one is Oracle of the Ancients, Tarot, Fate, Luck, Dreams, and Love. So I picked up the biggest one. Normally they come out with three different sizes of these. Super cute. I got that one. And then I have this one. It says Spellbook, a compendium of magical workings for your everyday spellcaster. Thought that one was really pretty. And then I also got the Complete Apothecary Anthology. And this one might be my favorite. I just think it is so pretty. Love that. And then they also came out with some wreath decoration kits and I haven't seen these until this year. So I think these are a new product and I picked up the witchy one, but they also had other ones as well. I think there was a ghost and maybe a vampire. I can't remember, but that's the one that I picked up. And then I'm not sure if this is new or not. It kind of looks new, but it's this fox wooden decor piece. I thought that was really cute. So I picked that up. And then this is definitely new. It's a wreath hanger with this beautiful sunflower on it. That is just gorgeous. And I love that they did the cream color to match. And they had a few different ones of these. I just can't remember what they were, but this one is definitely beautiful, love that. And then the next couple items Dollar Tree has had for the past several years, but they're just so good and I pick them up every year. So first is the color your own ornaments in the shape of the acorns and the foxes. You can do all kinds of things with these. You can turn it into a garland or an ornament or use them for your junk journal. So I picked some more of these up. And then I also picked up some of the fall leaf stickers and I use these in my junk journal. Thought those were really pretty. I also picked up more of the witch's brooms. I love decorating with these. So I got more of those. I also picked up some really pretty leaf ribbon. It's kind of got some glitter 
in there. Not sure if it's coming up on camera, but it's really pretty. And then I wasn't sure if they came out with these last year or not. They're the 3D acorns, but I thought they were really cute. And I definitely, I want to stain these and maybe do some sort of bronzy glitter on the cap. I thought that would be really pretty. And then I also picked up this crystal ball container and I've gotten these in years past. So I thought these would be really cute to put treats in to give as a gift. So you could do candies or small little cookies or even small little trinkets, little toys. Thought that would be really cute. And then last but not least from Dollar Tree is this little candy jar. And this is actually sealed, so you could put unwrapped candy in there if you wanted to. But this would also be a really cute gift idea as well if you wanted to fill it with things. But it says Witch's Brew. So cute. Now let's move on to what I got at Home Goods. So first up, I got the cat some more Halloween toys. These are so cute. So you get a little witch's hat, a spider, pumpkin, ghost, candy corn, and bat. And this was $6.99. And then I also picked up this Bad Witch Vibes Cat and Cauldron Bath Bomb Set. So you get the purple cat and then also a cauldron in there. And does it say the scent? Oh, spooky chai tea and sugar skull donut. Oh my goodness. Those are going to smell delicious. And these were $6.99. Then I also picked up some witchy stress balls. And this one actually glows in the dark. And it's of a crystal ball. And they're super soft. Love this. This was $4.99. And then I also picked one up for my husband. I'm trying to whisper because he's right in the next room. But I thought he would like this one for his desk at work. It's of a skull. And it's, oh my gosh, it's so cool. I don't think this one glows in the dark. No, it doesn't. But he is going to love this. This one was $4.99 as well. Then I also found this witchy pillow and normally the witchy Halloween pillows, they're obviously Halloween. They have spooky sayings on them. They, they're orange and purple and all that. So when I came across this one, that's just black and cream, absolutely beautiful. Had to get this and I can't remember. I. I believe this one was $24.99. The tag's not on it, but yeah. And it's super soft. Absolutely love this. This is gonna be an all year round piece for sure. Then I also found this witchy tear tray. Now mine's wobbly because it's it needs a bolt, which is an easy fix. So I can definitely do that. But as you can see, this part here is witches hats. And then the top part is witches hats as well. This is so cool and it will be a perfect year round piece. And then, oh my goodness. I, I'm not sure if this was the piece I was looking for last year, but it's very similar and you'll see why. It's this cauldron basket. I was looking for this forever last year, trying to find it. And what makes me think maybe this is a different version is because it has these gold handles here. And I think the one from last year was just all black, but uh, I'm so glad I found this. Love it. This was $14.99. Oh, and the tear tray. Did I already take the tag off? Oh no, this was $24.99. So I'm really excited about this. You could use these as a blanket basket or 
even for your puppies and cat toys, that would be really cute as well. Oh my goodness. Or if you have a fireplace, you could stack wood in here or do some sort of greenery or florals in here. That would be really pretty as well. So now let's move on to what I got at Spirit Halloween. So if you watched my last witchy haul at target i had picked up these beetle magnets well at spirit halloween they have this beautiful beetle mug absolutely love this and it actually has the moon phases on there and i love that it's not halloweeny it's not orange it doesn't say anything it just has the witchy beetle and then it's a purple color now i really wish it was green because green's my favorite color purple's really not my vibe but it's definitely a beautiful mug so i picked it up uh, and obviously i'm going to use it year round absolutely love that and then i also picked up a it's called a centerpiece and it's this lace cloth with the ravens on there let me see if i can take it out to give you a better look because i know there's a glare on the packaging but I thought this would even be beautiful as an altar cloth. But I am going to be doing a Halloween tablescape. So I thought about using it for that as well. But look how beautiful this is. Wow, this is actually bigger than what I thought. This is going to look beautiful on a tablescape. So maybe I'll use it for that. Absolutely love that. And then if you saw on the packaging... There's actually a matching altar cloth with the crows as well. Now, I didn't pick that one up, but that that's really pretty too. And this cloth was $9.99 and the mug was $16.99. And then also at Spirit Halloween, I picked up, it's called a glass sign. And it's of the moon, the moon phases and the pentacle on there. Absolutely love that. And this is heavy. So I think it's actually metal and it comes with a chain where you can hang it up. And I'm not sure if it's coming up on camera, but the glass is a purple color. So I'm going to be putting this on my window here in the altar room. Thought that would be really pretty. And then last but not least are the items that I picked up from Ross. So first up is this candle and it says Mystic Cauldron and it's Oriental Fig and Persimmon with Patchouli, Tobacco, Musk, and Cassis. And I absolutely love tobacco smelling candles. They just smell so good to me. And this one, oh my this one is going to go perfect in my office. It just brings off that old vintage grandfather study vibe. Absolutely love that. And this was $8.99. I also found these hand towels that say come in and sit for a spell. And it's a pack of two. And these were $4.99. Then I found a soup mug. A witchy soup mug and I thought these were so cute with the cauldrons and the witches hats and it's got the lid there and this was only $3.99 so I thought that was a really great deal I was trying to figure out if these green shapes were glow in the dark it doesn't say so maybe they're not but that's all right they're still really cute and then the last thing that I got from Ross and for this haul is this adorable stack of books with a witch hat and what caught my eye on this is that it has two sweet little mice that remind me of my remy and emile and unfortunately emile had passed away so i thought this would be a really cute reminder of them but absolutely love that it's got a little cobweb up there with a spider but I just really love the neutrals. So that is my entire Halloween haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, definitely give this video a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. 
Thanks, friends. Bye.